Welcome back to my channel, you guys. Today I thought it would be a really good idea to do a favorites video, kind of like holiday favorites because we're in holiday season and I have so many amazing things to show you. Let's jump right in. I think you guys are gonna love the things I'm gonna show you today. But before we get started, I'd really like to thank Scentbird for sponsoring today's video. You guys know I love my fragrances. I mean, I talk about fragrances all the time on every social platform. I just love a variety of fragrances. And what better gift to give this holiday season than a Scentbird subscription? This is so up my alley, you guys. So if you've never heard, Scentbird is a fragrance subscription that lets you try over six hundred brands of perfume. What I love so much about them is that when you get your subscription, you get to try a new designer fragrance every single month. They have perfumes, colognes, and a bunch of different unisex options. So this is like, this is the funny thing for me because so many people, and I've seen it online and I see people do perfume reviews and they're like, this is amazing. And I get so intrigued. I'm like, hmm, I want to try that. But like something that's amazing for someone might not be amazing for me. So what Scentbird does is they let you try a sample for 30 days. That way, if you love it, you can totally commit, get a full size bottle or try a new fragrance. It's so good, it's so good because it's not random at all. Like you get to pick exactly what you want. There's no surprises. So one of the ones that they sent me, I mean, all of them smell divine, but this one, oh, I love it. It's by MCM and it is just, how do I even describe how stunning that is? That really is stunning. I actually really love this. It's so fresh and clean. I don't know how to describe it besides how fresh it smells, which is so my taste in fragrance. Like I love a fresh, clean, but feminine smell. Like that's what I'm usually drawn to. It really is a stunning fragrance. I love it. It's only $11 for your first month and I have a 30% coupon code. You can check the link in my description box. Plus for all my Canadians, it's now available in Canada too. Make sure to check out Scentbird and thanks again for sponsoring today's video. So the first item I wanna show you is very exciting. Very, very, very exciting. This is from the Fendi Skims collection and I don't know if you're following me on Instagram or TikTok, but if you are, then you might already know what's inside. And if you're not, well, you should definitely follow. First of all, I was really, really excited for the collection to drop. And I was just really so into this whole concept. Fashion collabs these days are becoming very, very popular. A lot of designers are collabing together and a lot of like lower end with higher end designers are collaborating. I mean, We've seen this for a long time with H&M. H&M is kind of the most iconic and I feel like the leaders when it comes to these collabs because they've done all kinds of collabs with high-end designers. And then we've seen designers kind of like get into different spaces, different genres, kind of like, you know, even Gucci and North Face. That was a really cool collab. And then Gucci Balenciaga, like that was pretty iconic too. And you know, there's a lot of mixed reviews on these. Some people say it's like oversaturated with the collabs. Um, the last one was Fendi and Versace, Fendace. Um, and that I thought was awesome as well. But again, there were mixed reviews on that. This one just like had so much hype. It hit the stores and like, I feel like sold out immediately. Um, so I got in early. Here is the box. It's just like absolutely gorgeous. It's like purple box with the Fendi and Skims logo on it. I'll show it to you one last time. So here is the dress. I'm just absolutely stunning. Now, I explained on Instagram why I chose this dress. Like the reason I chose this dress out of everything that I saw from the Fendi Skims collection was because it was, you know, one of the pieces without the logo. Now, in terms of the whole collection, there were so many pieces that I loved that I wanted. I didn't want the logo. I tried to stay away from the logo. I'm gonna tell you why. I think that with these collabs, as much as they're amazing and iconic, and sometimes, oftentimes, collector's items, I also feel that they're very much right now in the moment. And with fashion, because it's so seasonal, I didn't wanna spend so much money on something that would in one year, one, one or two seasons from now, be like an outdated piece, you know? And then yes, 
you know, I, I do believe in like holding on to certain pieces and they come back in fashion like 20, 30 years later, you know, or even like a decade from now, it's so iconic. But I don't think it's smart to buy things just for it to one day be iconic or be so hot in the moment now. You know, like I like to buy things that I could wear over and over and over again. And I think this is a piece that I could do that with, you know, I can wear this in two, three years from now. And, you know, it won't be like, oh, that's the Fendi Skims. I mean, some people will know that it's Fendi Skims because it's, um, you know, recognizable from the collection, but it's not that recognizable, right? So, you know, when it comes to these kind of collabs, I like to buy the pieces that aren't as recognizable. I chose this dress because I thought it fit my body really beautifully. I think it just suits my curves. You know, I'm smaller in the waist, smaller torso and shoulders, and then like a little wider in the hips with like thighs and tush, you know, you guys know that by now. Um, and I just think this, you know, hugged my body beautifully, super flattering. And it's definitely one of my top favorites that I'm going to show you today because it is just such a beautiful dress. Like I can't wait to wear it. Um, I love the fabric. I love the feel, the fit. Um, there is like a small little logo at the back, but it's not really noticeable. And yeah, just a really, really, really beautiful piece. And just for your reference, I did get a size 36. So Fendi is so small, like Fendi sizes are so, so small. Um, you know, in some designers, I'm, I'm usually like 36, sometimes 34, but Fendi is like 36, sometimes 38 because their sizes are so big. So just for reference and keep in mind, if you, there's ever something you're looking at online with Fendi, you might have to size up, especially for like the tighter pieces. Anyway, so that's my first favorite I wanted to show you today. The Fendi Skims dress, just gorgeous. Oh my God, it smells so good. The next thing I wanna show you is one of the most incredible products I've ever used. These two bars right here are shampoo. Incredible, incredible shampoo. Now again, if you are following me on Instagram, you may have seen me talk about these before because I'm a huge fan, so much to the point where like, I would like want to invest in this business. I'm not sponsored by them. I just love this product. This is the shampoo and this is the conditioner. It's called Boheme. And I also did a video with the inventor. The inventor is a hairstylist. She knows I love this product so, so much. She's from Toronto. I'm from Toronto. I went to her and she did like a little on camera demonstration. Cause I, I told her, I'm like, I really want to show this, I wanna do a YouTube favorites video and I'd love to talk about your product. And obviously she was more than happy to let me talk about it, not sponsored whatsoever. First we wet the hair and we wet the bar and we give it a little rub to start the lather. I'm using the hydrate line, which is really good for hydration in the winter. It's got the most amount of shea butters. Which color is this one? Green, okay. it's called Nourish. has a little bit of eucalyptus oil in it, which is really good for dry scalp. Mm -hmm. A lot of people get dry scalp in the winter. Mm -hmm. And you can see they lather beautifully. And I lather the bar directly onto the scalp. Right in those areas. So heat protection, as well as like protection from the UV rays, because it has aloe vera in it, which contributes to the heat protection. And conditioner bar. You do rub it in your hands again, and then just work your mids to ends And I kind of rub it mm -hmm. to feel it getting into the hair. You can actually, I'll show you, you can, I'll show this to the video. You can actually see it kind of melting off into the hair. It feels so good when I use it in the shower. The longer that you leave it, the more the butters get to like penetrate the cuticle and it becomes more smooth and more silky, more shiny. So I brush it through shampoo and conditioner made from nut butters. It's sustainably sourced. Um, it's such clean ingredients. So there's, like I said, the shampoo, the conditioner, and then the stand. First of all, this one bar is three bottles of shampoo, three bottles of shampoo. Also because it's so clean and there aren't like gross chemicals in it, you don't have to wash your hair as often. My hair gets oily so fast and I don't really like to wash my hair more than twice a week. 
So with this, I feel like I get an extra two full days. You know, the health of your scalp is just as important as you know, the skin on your face, the skin on your body, right? There are three different kinds of shampoo. So like it tackles different needs for, you know, different hair, different hair textures, different scalp. It has heat protector, which is huge because the inventor of this product is actually a hairstylist. Like, I mean, she targets the main issues that we need for our hair and for our scalp. Something that's not full of disgusting chemicals, something that's clean, something that's good for our hair, good for our scalp, heat protectant, which is so important because we, you know, so many of us put heat in our hair, so much less packaging, one bar is three bottles of soap, no plastic, plus it lasts really, really long. Just a very, very, very good product. Just wanted to let you know about it and I will leave the information linked down below because it really is just that good. Okay. The next item I want to show you, as you can see, is this gorgeous Chanel ready to wear knit dress. This is absolutely stunning. Um, I did post a picture last week wearing this um, on my Instagram in this chair. Um, just absolutely gorgeous. I am in love, in love with this dress. I absolutely love it. Um, it's just a gorgeous knit dress. It's great for the holidays, but it's also just great for the win the fall winter season in general because it's a nice knit. It's like a beautiful knit. It it's something that you'd wear with like a pair of thick opaque tights and a beautiful pair of heels or boots. Um, just absolutely stunning. Absolutely stunning. I am so, so obsessed with it. This absolutely gorgeous knit. Like it's just so gorgeous. It's like a quilty knit. Like there's just like quilting details in the knit and then the metallic gold weaved in it's just so magnificent the gold buttons there's no logo on it so it's i mean it's it looks like chanel but it just looks gorgeous it's just gorgeous i absolutely cannot tell you how much i love pieces like this just stunning classic pieces like this is kind of very classic looking to me, very classic Chanel. And for this, I got a size 34. As I told you guys with the Fendi, I got a size 36, but in Chanel, um, I am kind of sometimes 34, sometimes 36. Um, for this, I needed a 34. It's very stretchy and I like it, you know, very fitted. Um, and it's not too short, even though in the photos I'm showing you, it looks very short, but it's just cause I'm sitting and it's, it's, you know, kind of like hiked up while I'm sitting. Uh, but it's kind of like to the mid thigh, which is just perfect, a perfect length. Um, you know, not too sexy, but not too conservative either. Fitted and gorgeous. The style is just beyond. And oh my gosh, I just love this piece so much. I really, really want to make a video of my Chanel ready to wear because I have like a very sick Chanel ready to wear collection that I've been building for a few years. And I really, really wanna make this video for you guys, but I was talking to my, my management team and they're like, I don't think people would like care that much for it. So I would love to know if you guys think I should do that because I think that a Chanel ready to wear collection could be just so epic. So let me know if you guys wanna see that because that's something I would love to film for you. Next thing I wanna show you is a skincare product and oh, I don't even know how to say it. A Lumiere, a Lumiere Ever Active C and E Plus Peptide Serum. I got this from my Toronto med spa that I go to. It's called V Beauty, um, and my girl Victoria does all my skin treatments. She told me this was a really good product, so I was like, okay, because I trust everything that she says, um, and it's just such a good skin serum. Usually in the winter, I feel my skin looks like crap. It's dull and it's dry and I have to add so much more additional hydration in my skincare routine. And I don't know why, like this product, since I've been using it, I don't feel that. And it's gotten really cold really fast. Like it suddenly got really cold here in Toronto and it's dry. Like I feel like it's dry in my house, but my skin doesn't feel dry. It feels hydrated and plump. And I just, <laughs> I feel like it's this. Um, because I just do feel a difference. I also really, I should mention that I did have an amazing skin procedure with Victoria and I should also include that in this favorites video because it was such a good procedure. I did show it on Instagram. It's called Profilo and it's 
the biggest, hottest procedure right now in skincare. And I don't wanna say the hottest because it's not like something that's a trend. It really is an amazing procedure for your skin. Again, it's called Profilo, and in here in Toronto, nobody does it except Victoria. She's the only person at V Beauty Spa that does Profilo, so I just feel so lucky that I, you know, I found her, um, and she just sell, sells really great products. So this serum, along with that Profilo procedure that I did, is just so incredible. Like, my skin feels incredible. And what Profilo is, is just like a bunch of, like, little injections. It's not a filler. You know, you're not putting, like, Restylane or whatever in your face, you're just it's it's just injections of hot the truest form of hyaluronic acid. So it's like very again clean and and um, she does she did it in my face and in my neck um, and along with this, it's just been so incredible for my skin. So wherever you're living, like you should really look into Profilo. It's a really really great procedure for your skin. And if you're in Toronto, you should check out V Beauty. Um, I always mention her on my Instagram and you can always DM me and ask me more questions about it as well. So yeah, Profilo and this like vitamin C and E serum, so good, a Lumiere. All right, and last for today, I wanna show you this winning lip combination that I've had for like probably a year and never really realized how good it was until like literally two weeks ago. I don't know, I really wasn't that into it. And then I got so into it, I don't know what happened. Like I get sent a lot of products with PR packages every single week. I just wanna show you guys what I love. You know, I really only kind of talk about the things that I really love and I wanna put you guys onto, right? I don't wanna just show you every PR package, like that's so boring. So I never showed you guys all the Charlotte Tilbury that was sent to me, I probably showed you a couple products, but this I never really talked about because I wasn't, I didn't think it was like for my coloring, like my, but then I don't know, lately I've been wearing it, like just changing it up and I love it. So it's the lip color that I'm wearing right now. This is Stoned Rose with Pillow Talk 2 Medium Lip Liner. And it's just this gorgeous shade of like, I don't know if this is considered in the nude family. It's like a tanny pink, right? So it's like in the nudie family, but it's it's darker. It's on my lips, I feel like it looks, you know, like a, a pinkish brown, right? Which is, I guess, what it is. Um, again, that's Stoned Rose. Really, really love it. And then Pillow Talk 2, which is like a medium, because Pillow Talk, I think, has a couple different shades. So this is like a deeper pillow talk because and also pillow talk i think is one of charlotte tilbury's biggest sellers most iconic shades of lipstick um so this is pillow talk too it's a bit deeper and then stoned rose it's just what i'm wearing on my lips right now i absolutely love it i love the formula it lasts really really long and i think the coloring works for me so that's why i wanted to add it because something that like you don't really see me wearing these kind of shades usually but i do love it so i wanted to include it here for you guys today. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching today. That wraps up my favorites video. I really enjoyed making this video for you, and I really wanted to show you all the products that I'm obsessing over right now because these are amazing products and also amazing fashion um, additions to my wardrobe, and I really wanted to show you them because I'm obsessed with them, and I can't wait to show you more of these looks, especially on my upcoming travels. So I hope you stick with me. And if you're not following me on my other social channels, please do. Everything's linked down below. Um, I'd also really like to thank once again, Scentbird for sponsoring today's video, which is also everything is linked down below. I hope you guys enjoyed. I can't wait to see you in my next video coming up soon. So until next time, bye for now. Bye.